Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to GB Gaming, and indeed, welcome back to Imperial Civil War 2.2, the preview version that the Thrones Revenge development team have very kindly given me to take a look at. In the last episode, we managed to take Sullust, albeit with probably more losses than we should have had, and then this geezer came for us. Look at him, Admiral Firmus Nance. He has come for us. He is a rebel. He is scum. And I don't think we can win this battle. I'd like to try and chip away at them a little bit, but I don't fancy my chances. Look at six A-wings, three Y-wings, of course, Nance himself, which I think is in a... He's in a Home 1 type cruiser. I just simply don't think we can win that. So we're going to auto-resolve. We did take an A-wing squadron and a B-wing squadron, which is lovely. Now, let's jump our fleet in and see if we can face off against them. Sounds like a plan to me. <laughs> tactical battle imminent. Ah, tactical, eh? I don't know how to use tactics. Let's see if we can win this. I'm feeling pretty good about it. I've uh, been brushing up on my skills. <laughs> Ish. Right, let's begin the battle. We're of course going in with one ship again and we're going to jump the whole fleet on top of them when we get the opportunity. Let's see how this goes. Down you come. Choose your reinforcements. Get the reinforcements ready. Now the Praetor should last very well. We do have a couple of Tartans. Which should be okay. Ah, oh, look at him. Firmus Nance. Absolute sausage. There they are. Blast them. Right, the first thing that Getting we're going to do, we're going to drop this. Hello, shippity dip. Your command, sir. My command is don't let them leave. And my next command is going to be kill them all. Right. We shall be let's there get shortly. One, right away. Two. Moving up. Three. And a Praetor. Ah, the hell with it. Let's have Heading all four. Out. Coming about. Destination confirmed. <laughs> We're on our way. <laughs> we'll be there shortly. <laughs> Everyone. <laughs> Kill him. Oh, Firmus Nance! You didn't expect this lunacy, did you? Oh, wow, look at that. Some... God, he's nearly down already. Batteries online. Batteries online. The enemy has been defeated. <laughs> now that was a quick battle. That is how you beat the rebels. Two quasar fires and Firmus Nance down. Tactical battle imminent. Oh my lord. Where's Clackador? 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 Oh, how did they get here? What do they have? Five X Wings, three Nebulon B frigates, a quasar fire, a Dauntless. Say, so, uh, interesting. Corellian gunship and A wing. Don't fancy my chances here. Let's try it anyway. Whoa, a couple of nice quick fire battles to start this round off. Once a rich jungle world, the ecosystem of Clackador. Uh, seven was ruined by biological warfare, with the surviving inhabitants forced into vast domed cities to escape from the irradiated swamps and mutilated wildlife. Let's have a little fight above it, shall we? Now, I Ready for action. do Upgrade not in, in any way expect to win recording. this, but I expect to have a pretty awful time. Ready for orders. Got a couple of bomber wings. Tie squadron here. A couple Course of tie set. wings. I think that's all we're going to get. Reporting in. 
bombers at the Upgrade ready. Complete. Ready to receive orders. Oh, we've got orders, three tyrants. Ready for command, sir. Three tie wings. The enemy is approaching. Still not great, but now I think what we're probably going to need to do. Com link active. Tie squadron standing by. Right, ties. Ready for battle. Your control two. I need you to go and instructions received. Just get them for the empire. Upgrade complete. Squad one. Um, go for the fighter bay on the quasar fire. Take out those X-Wing. Roger that. Oh, look at that Rebel fleet incoming. Oh, X-Wings, no. <laughs> okay, here we go. The fight has begun. Just tie that X-Wing up. See if we can kill him. Wow. Uh, the answer to that is a resounding no. Go after the stragglers. Oh, we're having a bad time, ladies and gentlemen. Regroup for another attack. That's it. More enemy craft. Taking fire. Sir, I, I've got him. I don't think you do have him. Oh. Come on. I think maybe we need to retreat. Or perhaps we'll just... Um, oh no, there isn't an auto result. Oh, there is. Here we go. Or, let's just auto result this. There was no winning. Just the pure amount of fighters that they had. It would have been impossible. Bring our main fleet back. Try Building and rebuild the station. Construction complete. Ah, let's build Building a capital shipyard at Sullust. Constructing. We have a trade station as well. They've left. My my. You're building a big ship. <laughs> Building under construction. Let's get a heavy frigate shipyards down there. And I think we'll grab a couple of golems. Constructing. Which I think would be wise. Interestingly, we can't build any cruisers quite yet. Oh, I don't suppose we would be able to, would we? Ah, uh, the cruisers will be built here. Construction complete. Construction complete. Let's see what we have. Hello, hello, hello. 60,000, and we can get Captain Cronus. Now you're talking. So, to facilitate that, of course, what we probably want to do is we're probably building under construction as many constructing money making ventures as we possibly can building throughout under the world. Construction. Throughout the world? Throughout the galaxy. Building under construction. Constructing. Building under construction. And I think over here is there anything that we can build. Well we can give ourselves a little bit of extra Unit defense. In production. There we go. That'll do here over at Clackador. Construction can complete. Also, ultimately, we'll also be complete. able to grab some golems. Construction complete. Construction complete. Oh, Construction look at that money going complete. up. <laughs> Construction complete. Construction complete. Come on. There we go. Beginning Construction. Grab a couple of golems. Then it's simply going to be a matter of waiting, really. Let's get down here with our main fleet. 
And think about it, Eshron. Construction complete. Construction yeah, so complete. Here. Everything seems fine. Short term, not concerned. Let's build a heavy frigate shipyard over here. I'm tempted to get a Vedusia over Sullust at some point. Of course, we want uh, cash first. Always cash first. Construction complete. Let's try and take the orbit of Elrude. Construction complete. Oh, hello, hello. Who's this, then? Another naughty man? An early member of the Old Republic, joining sometime before 22,000 BBY, Palini became important over a millennia. Well, this is Elru, not Palini. How dare you? That's something I'll mention to Corey. Uh, I think perhaps that's incorrect. Unless Paulini is indeed... Oh, they've got two. Well, well, well. Choose your reinforcements. Already the reinforcements? Looks like they've got two Star Destroyers here. Both of which contain a hero. Contain the right word? I think it probably isn't. Oh, the well. enemy has been spotted! Right, let's see. What are they called? Akal Zed. He's an excellent commander. And, uh... Trill. So, we'll do practically what we did before. Fallout. Pop one here. Let's move Pop out. one here. Let's go. Pop one here. One Moving more here. And this time, we're going to need the big boy. Right away. Moving out. Positioning. Heading out. And All out. Unit oh, look how quickly they're taking it down. Goodbye, enemy victory star destroyer, but they are taking us down quite quickly as well. All right, let's focus on this target. Oh, he's not liking that, is he? He's not liking that at all. Good. Bye, Akal Zed. Right. It's your turn, Tanda. The might of the Empire is upon you. Actually, you're the Empire. We are victorious. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. They will disintegrate in orbit. Excellent. Taking the orbit. Lovely. Construction complete. Construction complete. Put these guys together. Move down to Glovia. Well, I think now that we're in a position, Adjusting Nava computer. we may as well grab these guys as well. Gador is behaving. We are still awaiting the 60,000. Mm, not Cruiser even close reporting. to being there, but uh, ultimately we'll get where we want to be. Let's take a look. Doesn't look like it's very well defended on that. Oh, Clackador, Clackador. What have we got at Clackador? That's going to be another loss, I expect. Oh, Clackador, why have you forsaken me? Oh, we do have one Golan. Well, let's go. Let's fight this. I thought I didn't think we'd got a Golan completed, but it appears that we have. Nice. Are they called Golans or Golans? <laughs> Surely it's Golan. Station ready. Upgrade in progress. Form up. Engines activated. Awaiting. Okay. Everybody orders. over here. Do you do anything special? Rotate. Structure. Hmm. Haven't seen that before. Roger that. Engines activated. Roger that. Form up. Location plotted. I had a difficult childhood. Upgrade. Complete. Awaiting orders. 
Ion engines primed. This guy's got a fighter bay. Enemy unit sighted. Hello, hello. Copy. Setting up my run, sir. See what we can do about these A-wings. Oh, are they running? Nope, stay here. Receiving orders. Well, they didn't like that. Upgrade complete. Orbital command available. Orbital command available. <clears throat> Let's speed it up a little bit, being as we're being so defensive. Sickeningly so. Copy. Commencing attack run. Changing course to intercept. Let's see what we can do against these A-wings. Probably not a lot is the answer. Sir, I... Ah! What are you doing? I've got him. Ah! <laughs> I copy. Acquiring ah! target. Advancing on target. Oh. Commander, they're hitting us. Where'd he go? Right, looks like we're trying to take out some Y wings up here. Nowhere to run. Fingers crossed that's going to falling out of formation. Help us a bit. I'm losing. Ah! Space so station fire. under attack. Oh, yes, come on, the Golan. I've got it. Formation. Ah! Oh yeah, take out that quasar fire. Excellent. I copy. Reporting. Everyone, Bombs take out the bombers. Go after the stragglers. Oh, anyway, wait. Oh, good lord. Regroup for another attack. They're coming in quick. See, now is where we're going to run into trouble. More enemy craft. Target I'd like you to lasers. try and take out the Nebulon B. How are we doing against Commander, their bombers? They're hitting us. Where'd he go? Yes, sir. Sir, I. Well. Not well. Uh, I've detected. Uh, 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 Space station uh, under attack. Activating energy flux. Nowhere to run. Space station is under attack. Uh, uh, oh look, we're starting to take uh, her down. Uh, it's one laser cannon uh, down. Uh, uh, we have their bombers tied up still. We're certainly not winning against them, but Sir, I... I've got him. Ah! There she is. Falling out ah! of formation. Draw their fire. Attack formation. <laughs> Go after the stragglers. Looks like she's having some success against the A-wings. She's turned as well. I've got him. Ah! Yes, Commander. Let's keep those bombers tied up. Maybe if we take out the larger uh, ships. Let's try it. Uh, uh, in quick. More enemy craft. Sir, I, <laughs> I'm losing. Uh, I've got him. Space station uh, under uh, attack. Uh, 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 Reporting. Keep them tied up. Keep them tied up. Commander, they're hitting us. Where'd he go? Uh, uh, we're having a hard time taking out that CC uh, seven seven zero zero. Nowhere to run. Doesn't have any hard points, which is making it a little bit difficult. And we are running out of shields on our goal. What? Nearly done. All right, let's concentrate on that. Shields are so close to down. Ready. Bombs deployed. Sir, I draw their fire. I've got it. Attack oh, she's going down. Go after the stragglers. Ah. That's right. Tear her apart. Uh, uh, and again. The enemy has been yes! Activated. That Space is the way attack. to do it, ladies and gentlemen. That is the way to do it. A stunning victory. Uh, the CC7700 doesn't appear to have uh, an icon yet. I'm sure that will do in the near future. Ooh. I am... Um, I'm delighted with myself. <laughs> uh, right, let's 
constructing. Pop another golem on the enemy build. Fleet approaching. We've got an enemy fleet approaching somewhere, but first, before we do that, I would like to try and take El Rood. Tactical battle imminent. What? Glomtho. I don't think I've got anything good at Glomtho. Just zoom in. Do I even have a station? Uh, Admiral Akbar. Admiral Akbar and two Imperial Star Destroyers. Fascinating. I don't think we're going to win this. At all. I'm tempted to auto resolve. Yeah. Cruiser reporting. That's not overly surprising. Enlisting troops. Let's grab some land units. And come on. Ground attack on El Rood, please. That's what we've been warning all episode. Let's get her done. Invasion commencing. Oh, looks like we might win this. <laughs> ah, this also has Polini's reference as well. So yep, yeah, that does look like it's a little bit of a glitch. Choose your reinforcements. Which will almost certainly get patched out. Uh, let's grab a floating fortress. Destination set. Oh, what else might be good? Right away. Nice set of tie crawlers. Can't go wrong. And uh, last but not least, let's get these. On the way. Unit capacity. What a substantial uh, area. Reporting in. Roger that. Form up. Awaiting orders. Put all of our troops in there. Right. Well, let's we'll move back in. You up. I think Bosk should be able to take. What can you do? Look, sir, it's them. Look, sir, droids. Oh my, we have a view of large amounts of the city. This is quite good for us. And the reason this is good for us is because we can use a bombing run at our leisure. T2B, copy. We're just going to take our time here. Let's fast forward. Copy. Take uh, a nice anti infantry turret, shall we? Construction complete. We nearly have a bombing run available. Let's push forward. Support order acknowledged. Bombing so run available. A bombing run is available. Bomber standing by. Let's see if we can uh, catch Initiate them here. Initiate attack run. I think we might get these tie crawlers. Commencing bombing run. Oh, that is unfortunate. Target locked. Moving to secondary position. That's one unit of enemy infantry dealt with. We'll back you up. Where are these guys going? Oh, they're up here. Let's keep fast forwarding. This is not as terrifying as I thought it might be. We've secured a landing zone. Let's grab turret a anti infantry turret. And Moving out. lots and construction complete. And Moving lots. Out. And Advancing. lots. Advancing. And Advancing lots of stormtroopers. <laughs> Oh, these guys. 
Uh, they don't look happy. Bombing run available. Well, we do have another bombing run available. Bomber squad Highly unlikely recording. that we're going to catch it or catch any of these off guard. See where they go. Yep, Commencing okay, here. bombing run. Commence attack run. We've sighted them. Oh dear. Lost a unit there. That's it. Keep running. I think this is likely to be it for them. <laughs> we are victorious. Very nice indeed. We've taken El Rude. Let's return to System the Galactic control League. achieved. Oh, after viewing the Ariadu Authority's considerable strength, we've decided it would be prudent if our forces were to join with yours. That Reporting. sounds lovely. Ah, uh, and look who we have. Let's just take a quick look through our new generals. And pause for a moment. Come on, you. Be off with you. Cruiser okay. reporting. We'll pause. We have uh, Moff Villas Andal. Moff Andal was, by all accounts, a lazy and incompetent if well-connected administrator who typically left administration to the sector governor while he spent his time abroad. He was responsible for fostering rivalry between Captains Prill and Zed, the best of the Elrood sector fleet. Speaking of Prill and Zed, here they are. In, uh, here's Prill. Uh, in space battles, Thunderflare deploys the Obsidian Squadron Hero Unit. Prill came from an influential family within the Empire, which assured her place within the Naval Academy where she quickly demonstrated her own abilities. After attaining the command of the ISD Thunderflare, she was assigned to Darth Vader's own Death Squadron. After the Battle of Endor, she was one of the many to refuse to listen to Gilead Pallion, instead choosing to return to the Elrude Sector. And we have Akal Zed. We've fought them before, we've beaten them before. Captain Zed was a member of Moff Vilis and El... Oh, Moff Vilis and El Elrude Sector fleet after the Battle of El Endor where he developed an intense rivalry with Captain Prill. Along with Prill, he had been part of Death Squadron and returned to Elrude rather than following the orders of Captain Pallion. Nice! So we have additional hero units. Is that not magnificent? Let's just see. The, the size of the fleet looks pretty... Oh, no, 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 no. Um, <clears throat> I understand now. This guy looks like he should be on a planet. So let's... Uh, well, in fact, what we can do with him, we'll put him in a separate fleet. We'll try and put him in a separate fleet, there he is. Uh, and then Reporting. we will have him go down to Solast. But, thinking about it, that, ladies and gentlemen, is all we have time for for this episode. Uh, as I said at the start of last episode, we will be streaming live on our Twitch channel on Friday. Uh, we'll be doing three episodes worth, if you like, so three lots of half an hour uh, at an absolute minimum. And uh, it would be really good if you could join me. Uh, so jump onto my Twitch channel, which is uh, twitch.tv forward slash thegbgaming. It's all one word, no spaces. Uh, click the follow button and join me at 8pm GMT on Friday. Um, there, you can tell me what I'm doing wrong, tell me what I'm doing right, and advise me on the best strategy to win this campaign. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for watching. Uh, if you've enjoyed what you've seen, please do uh, hit the like button, uh, share the video if you like, and definitely give me some comments, give me some tips and pointers. For now, this is The Gull, out.